Take a look at your screen. We are turning our attention to a legislative district in the Tennessee House. Since 2013, Roger Kane has held the seat in District 89 that spans parts of Northwest Knox County, includes almost 60,000 people. And we welcome two Democrats vying for that job. Kaifel Agostini and Colleen Martinez are with us, and thank you both for being here. Hi, thank you. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. Colleen, let's start with you and sure. why you're running. Um, I'm running because I want to make sure that we're doing everything we can for our children in Tennessee. I want to make sure that they can grow, learn, thrive, and succeed in whatever future that they want to have. So to do that, I want to make sure we fully fund public education, we expand health care, or we expand Medicaid so everyone can have access to affordable health care, and that we enact gun safety legislation. All right, we'll dig into those topics sure. in a moment. Kaifel, why are you running? Um, so I, at the beginning of this year, there was actually no one running, and um, I'm a naturalized citizen. So one of the things I remembered was that in order for our democracy to work, you have to participate. So I decided that this would be a good time for me to participate in our democracy. Um, I believe that we have an opportunity to um, reach across the aisle make sure that we're getting stuff done rather than just pointing fingers and screaming at each other in the ether. And mm -hmm. Kaifel, for people who don't know, what part of your background do you think helped prepare you for this role? Um, I've spent the last 13 years working at the largest retail technology company doing tech support. And part of my job was listening to people's concerns and addressing them. So I think that you know being a state representative is an extension of listening to the concerns of our constituents and addressing those concerns. Certainly a big customer service element to it. Mm -hmm. Colleen, how about you? What has prepared you? Well, I'm a, a wife and a mother of two children. My husband is an engineer at Oak Ridge National Laboratory. My son Josh will be a sixth grader at Cedar Bluff Middle. My son Willie will be a fourth grader at uh, Cedar Bluff Elementary School. And in many of the communities that I have lived in, I have either worked a little bit or uh, mostly volunteered in the community. So recently I've been a substitute teacher. I'm a PTA member, a chess club director, a Tennessee Achieves mentor, a youth basketball coach, and I have volunteered with the Special Olympics. And in those things, I'm just always out in the community looking for how I can make things better. And even on the campaign trail, I have found more projects to do, like a fitness trail in Carnes and a fitness court in Knox County. And uh, we're working on an outdoor classroom at Cedar Bluff Middle School. So I just see representing Northwest Knox County as just an extension of what I've already been doing. You brought up education and Kaifel, let's talk about some issues now. What can Democrats who face a supermajority in Tennessee do about some of their priorities, which includes education? It sounds like that may be an issue in which you share some agreement, but how do you feel um, you can move forward on education? Well, uh, one of the interesting things about this particular election is even though the Republicans hold a supermajority, there are 97 of the 99 seats are actually contested. So there is a hope that you know the Democrats can take some of that back and we can all work together because at the end of the day, if we, you know, even if we are in disagreement, we have to live together in the state, in our communities. So we need to figure out a way to work together to make sure that we are our teachers are better paid and we're not just you know wasting a lot of money on things that don't actually matter to our constituents in particular on teacher pay how much should a, a new teacher make that that is a very difficult question um, the teacher pay rate the range of pay for teachers I believe starts like a kindergarten teacher starts at twenty thousand dollars if I'm not mistaken that is a little, we're asking these people to be responsible for our children on a daily basis. Um, $20,000, you can't, you know, you, most people can't live on that. That's a little unreasonable. So we should probably be, look, be looking, honestly, mid-30s, depending on what grade and how many children are in the classroom. All of these things, they're, uh, $30,000 may be useful here. It may not work in Nashville. 
fair point. Uh, I think in Knox County, the, the wage is closer to that as a starting teacher. Um, Colleen, what do you feel about teacher wages? Where should they be? Are they high enough? No, teacher wages are not high enough. My friends are teachers. Mm -hmm. I also have friends that work as staff at Knox County Schools. Our teachers are having to take on second jobs to make ends meet. Our staff members are taking on second jobs. So to what's make a ends fair meet. wage? Right. Um, currently, the average salary for starting teachers in Knox County is 38000 mm -hmm. The National Education Association is advocating for a starting teacher salary to be 40000 nationwide. And uh, I think that's a great place to start in Tennessee is to, is to uh, put forth legislation to have starting teacher salary as $40,000. To Kiefel's point, should teachers in a place like Nashville, which is a more expensive place to live, be higher? I say let's just work on an average salary of $40,000. And because even here in Knox County, the teachers are paid something different here than what they are in Sevierville, Alcoa, Maryville, that sort of thing. So if we can across the board just have an average, be able to average it out so that everyone's at least making 40000 I think that's a great place to start. We're going to dive into some more issues. We've got to take a quick break on here on Inside Tennessee, but back with more with these two Democrats who would like to serve in the 89th District.